So back in September, when I was still moving stuff from Mr. Harper's house to the new shop, uh, I was driving down the road and somebody had put a machine out for the trash people. So I just stopped to pick it up. I can see right now that it needs a drain. Drain hose and they took the back off. Mm, hope I got one of those. Make another trip over to Mr. Harper's. Evaluate it. Probably tomorrow. Huh. I'll leave long in the tooth for this day. Needs dogs. That's all right. We'll fix that. then I need to put the back back on it. Okay. All messed up here. Been up trying to get in it. They didn't know what they were doing. Pop these clips off. You don't know how to get in the machine. Look at a YouTube video. You wind up damaging. I got this machine yesterday while I was running back over to Mr. Harper's to see if I had left a, um, a drain hose for that machine out there. I didn't, but I, this one was on the side of the road. 
And when I went by the first time, it wasn't there. When I came back, it was out there. And uh, people just set them on the side of the road for somebody to pick up. So I picked it up. It is kind of dirty. But not in too bad a shape. I'll move it out here. Clean it. They didn't know how to get into it. It has a motor and a water pump. No drain holes. But, I think by Mr. Harkless and I picked up some drain hoses that I had left over there. I'm still getting bits and pieces. Uh, I'm assuming this thing had a leak. Because everything pertaining to water seems to be missing on it. This probably went to a different kind of water valve. Let's see if it's not it done. Got the wrong water valve on it. Two five sixteenths screws They're here somewhere. And there's one, there's another. No, that's not one. I had these separated out. Separator now. What do I do with them? See, it's going to take getting used to. I got stuff mixed up. Don't know where it is. It's probably it right there. Looks good. Clutch looks brand new. There we go. This right here. Let me see if I got one of those plastic pieces.
that I used to keep the Lazy Susan over here. Plastic pieces. And then there. There's some plastic pieces. Not what I'm looking for. Oh, I need to take that to the house. did something with them. Maybe I'm just not looking enough. We're in the right spot. I need one of those. There they are. See, you just got to look. You have to find out where your stuff went so you can get efficient again. here the other goes here and this goes up in here like this might be easier to pick it up and do it there it will be back a little bit and put this piece right here and right there bring them back together and turn it 90 degrees as you can see this keeps this back from falling over now, let me look in the truck. Get my drain hoses. of it goes this, this away. <clears throat> you think after all this time I'd know the difference, wouldn't you? Uh, 
perfect. Now, the sad thing is, that should be made for a smaller. Just dog it. This one that is that midway. Let me see if I got another one. These are the wrong kind. No, no. That'd be a way to do that. That's going to be the only one. <coughs> only one of those that I have. Several of these. These outside. Size. Do you know what? I'm engine, ingenious enough to make this work. PVC hauler. Work on that.
Yeah. What we'll do is we'll glue the heck out of that. Unlock it, fool. glue on it. <clears throat> now The thing for you to do here is make do when you oh, when you can't. Uh, look at that. Is what in the sink? It was nasty. He likes canned food. What do you think? He hasn't eaten today. Okay. Now. You know what? I need another clamp, don't I? There you Hope we can get this clamp over there. Wally. Wally, come. Does, does this change stuff like that? Yeah, back there. He's gonna stay there till you tell him to go. Come. Sit. Good boy. What you smell in there? It's a rat. Mice. I'm got you some food. Well, that'll work. 
That won't work on my test track, though. Let me turn it sideways. I think that'll be alright. You have to order a hedge? Not necessarily, but to be sure you get one. Do you want to eat round 11? Oh, sure. We need to reassemble the demolition here. this machine I don't think I get into it by taking all this stuff apart and they probably got frustrated so let's just go buy another machine instead of calling me to fix it But their frustration is my game. opening. Huh? What is a grand opening? Like a it's just more of those expensive signs. No. Just, it's advertised grand opening. You have a, a, a and the mayor come and yeah. <laughs> That's not, that might run them off. <laughs> yeah. I will take that out of the tape.
Oh yeah, these agitator dogs for sure. Need to get rid of that. Cause we don't want that on our machine. No fabric softener. Ooh, those dogs are gone. Let me get a bypass. And see if that will come on. Wait a minute, what is that? There's no power cord. Great. Sure hope I got one. What do I do with those power cords? What did I do with all those power cords? Well, I did something with them. I think I brought them with me. We have to run back over to Mr. Harper's. Well, I know I have power cords. Well, I put them in a five gallon bucket. I'm sure I'll put them in a five gallon bucket. Oh, dang it. Well, my scrapper friend had hauled all my stuff off for me. He actually brought this machine to, to have fixed. And I, I, I was looking for my power cords and I said, I can't find my power cords. And he says, we hauled them off. I said, no, I didn't. I put them in a bucket. He said, five gallon bucket? I said, yeah. We hauled them off. Nah, went up to the house and looked. And sure enough, we hauled them off. All the power cords that I've been saving. So what I'm going to have to do, I have a power cord like this. And I'm going to, I don't have a... No. Jimmy hauled it off. Well, I had a bucket of cords, but uh, these were hanging on the wall at Mr. Harper's, and I was going through them, and I said, I need to haul this one off, this one off, this one off, and I, I dropped them in a bucket. Come here, Wally. I got to go get our watches. But I dropped the good ones. Wally, come. Back here with the dog. Wally, come. Come, come. Come here. You better, uh oh, somebody done eat your, that big old dog done eat your lunch, hadn't he? It's a good thing that you sh you share your breakfast with your friends, huh? Maybe we'll get in the dog fight. That you dog, me. that dog's awful. Docile. Docile. I'll be right back.
Come on. 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 Anyway, unfortunately, all my power cords are gone. I'm just going to splice this one in there for now. I have to have the right, the correct power cord. But I don't. Mom left it at you. Go on now, y'all get out of here. Get out, out, out. Oh, mad the dog. Just call you blockhead. I'll put this knot in it so it'll pull back through. My oldest son, his first word that he ever uttered was tractor. He loved machines, and he still loves machines. He's an aircraft mechanic now. Go on out of here. You're looking for something to eat now. You already ate Wally's. You already ate Wally's breakfast, because he didn't eat it. I know he didn't. Now at least we can test it. Oh. 
Look at there. She spins. This is off. Plug that back in. Okay, spins. All we need to do is test it. I'll tell you what, let's put some dogs in there. Let me get some more splashers. Okay. Uh, stop for lunch. Yeah, we're back at this machine now, and we're going to change the agitator cams or dogs. Or I wanted to look at this bolt. It's got grease on it. Got a lot of rust on it. Maybe I will take it over here and brush some rust off of this thing. Safety squints. Anyway, we're going to change those agitator dogs and bring it over here and test it out. Oh, my sweetie's been in the paint locker and left everything open. Working with your wife. My OCD is going to get overloaded with her. Pop this retainer off. Just pop it up. Get rid of the old cams. Install the new ones. I want these to flop, flop, flop around. Not too much. Good deal. I see these ears right here. These ears, there's two little posts right there. You can see these two little posts. This one's good. We want to fit this down in there. Yeah, it fits on those posts. I'd snap it and you can lift the whole thing up. Now, let's reassemble it. First, let's get all this trash out of here. Get something to put it in. Oh, I 
pencil. It's a tin. Them all come out in the wash, won't they? Now, take our bolt, start it with a magnet. And let's get a cover for that thing. There's one. That's not the right one though. What is that going to take? I'm going to make it one of these. Not sure. Maybe it. That's it. Yep. So let's take it over here and give it a test run. Painters are back to blue and knock that heavy rascal off the rollers. have a short a shorter hose than normal Harper and Knowles. Hey, yeah, this is uh, Tim. I live out in Oakdale, and uh, I had uh, my dryer quit working on me. I was wondering uh, if you could maybe have a look at it. Sure. Uh, uh, do you know how long it would take to fix it? Just off, I mean, I know it's not easy to, you know, diagnose on the phone like that, but. What's it doing? Uh, so it was working last night. I think my wife might have had just a little bit too big of a load there, and it just kind of stopped, you know, but it. it I think it's like stripped. I don't know if that's maybe part of the problem, but like it sounds like it wants to spin, but it's just not catching. So this video is getting kind of long, so I'm going to cut it off right here. And I have a part two, but I'm going to put the links up above and in the description below for the second part. Anyway, thanks for watching this part of it, and I'll see you on the next one. Chip is out.